Hello everyone. Welcome back to my online maths class. Today, first I am going to tell a story. And after listening this story, you can understand what I am going to teach you. So, let's begin. One day, a teacher called the meeting of numbers. So, here you can see all the numbers came except zero. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All the numbers came except zero. So, the teacher ordered the numbers to find zero. All the numbers searched for zero, but they could not find him. At last, all the numbers found that zero is hiding behind the tree. Can you see? Zero is hiding behind the tree. So, the teacher asked zero, why are you hiding? So, Zero started crying and said, I have no value. That's why I am crying. The teacher asked number one to stand before zero. So, then he asked, what is the value of one? So, all number started shouting. 10, 10, 10. The teacher added one more zero and asked, Now what is the value of zero? All the numbers started shouting 100, 100, 100. Now zero become a hero. My dear students, Today, I am going to teach you the concept of zero. So, let's begin. So, my little kids, what is zero means? Can you tell me? Zero shows no objects. Zero shows no objects. If I am saying zero toffees, in my hand that means I have no toffee. So zero means nothing. Zero means nothing. Now everybody just see I have two baskets. I have how many baskets? Two baskets. In this basket nothing is there. Right? And another one, I have an apple. How many apples are there? Yes, you are right. Number one apple. So, I am writing here number one. Yes. And then, see this basket? Is there anything? Nothing is there. So, what should I write? Yes, nothing is there. So, nothing means I have to write here zero. I have to write here zero. So, zero means nothing. Zero means nothing. From here, you can learn English also. Already you have learned vowel and consonant. So, here one apple is there. Okay, so can you tell me before apple, what should I write? A apple or an apple? What is the spelling of apple? A P P L E so, A is a vowel or consonant. 
Yes, you are right. A is a vowel. So before vowel, we should write an. So an apple. An apple. Now I am giving another example. Here you can see one banana is there. Okay, so how many banana? One, only one. So first I am writing here the spelling of banana. B A N A N A Banana B A N A N A Banana So what is the beginning letter of banana? B So B is a vowel or consonant? We know very well how many vowels are there? Yes, A, E, I, O, U. Only five vowels are there. That means B is a consonant. Yes, so before consonant, we should write A. So, a banana. A banana. So, zero. Here, you can see zero. Zero means what? Zero means nothing. Zero means nothing. So, when zero is placed before any number, okay, is does not increase the value of that number. That means here, zero, one is equals to only one. Understood? But when we add 0 after any number, okay, it increases the value of that number. So, 2, 0, 20 is equals to 20. That means when we add 0 after any number, the value gets changed. Like this. So now we will do one activity. Here you can see I have written some numbers. Okay. So my first number is 0, 9. My first number is 0, 9. So 0, 9 is equals to only 9. Only 9. But my second number is 9090. So 9090 is equals to 90. Okay. And my next number is 02. So 02 means 02 is equal to only 2. But my Next number is 5050. So 50 is equals to 5050. So in this way you can read all these numbers by your own. I hope you all have enjoyed my this session. So that's all for today. Bye bye everyone.